Hey everybody, Inger Puncher here, and we're back playing Metroid Fusion. Not sure there's anything over here or not. Alright, we're starting to get to the point where I, I have not practiced so much. I've been through this- oh, would you just hover already? There we go. And uh, if you drop a power bomb right here, you can kill all those uh, crabs over there, and it'll whoop, whoop, suck all the health in for you. And you roll- ah, there's a channel over here you can roll through. And I'm not sure what's at the bottom of this- oh, you know, I remember what's down here. Okay. Anyway, blow out these, and blow out these to clear out some space for yourself. And then put a power bomb down somewhere around here. You kill all these crabs. You don't want to pick up the X parasites, though. Just wait. So, pick that one. Okay, hopefully we can still get around them. Alright, cool. Now, you can take the rest if you want. Clear out these missile blocks. And shoot some missiles in there. I totally missed. Wow, okay. Have to go in there and get them. Eh. The charged plasma shot should penetrate. And once you kill them... You have to let them turn into gold and then kill them, and that will open this door. See, it's one of those special conditions doors where you have to do something before it opens. That's what you have to do, is you have to wait for it to turn to, uh... What you call it? Uh... Gold crabs. And then defeat the gold crabs, and that's what opens the door. If you just kill the enemies and grab up all the ex... Uh... Parasites without killing the, them for a second time, you won't get this ex this energy bank right, right here. And I'm telling you, you want to come over here and get this. It's not very far out of your way. It doesn't take that very long. Actually, you don't have to bomb me, so you can just shoot them too, so that's an even faster way to get out. Now, you see in the background there? There's something crawling around in the background of this, this cell here. You see that thing? What is that right there? I can't tell. You can't interact with it either. So I don't, I don't actually know what, what that's supposed to be. It looks like a jellyfish or something. Like a sponge? I don't know. Anyway. Go ahead and... Oh, I hit the, I hit the lip right there. We can go. We could have accessed this room earlier by cutting through this here. This is where we had to bomb through the floor to get down. Instead, we come to the right now and shoot out that door. Now it's unlocked. This is the one that we got stuck at. We had to the other from the other direction. We had to blow out the ceiling of this and go around. See now all the doors are unlocked. We can come out the easy way. We had to like come in through the secret channels, and now we got to. Uh, we get to go out the shortcut essentially. Get on my face, man. Oh, come on! I guess it, I don't know, maybe hitting them with all three beams does more damage. I'm not sure. It certainly seems like it does. Because sometimes when I hit them with just one, they don't die, and I feel like they should have. Anyway, it's pretty obvious here that this is also another weak spot, so we kind of just power bomb it. We get a nice hole. Everyone loves a nice hole, right? God, that was awful. I think I just said that. Anyway, y'all probably embarrassed. See many as we can kill at once. We gotta love the plasma beam going through enemies. You gotta try and corkscrew into that hole here. God, corkscrewing in the holes? Man, what are you even talking about? This is ridiculous. Anyway. Just keep going after these obese seahorses, which seem to only be affected by charged shots or missiles. Although I'm not really sure why. I wouldn't think a seahorse would be particularly, you know, armored, but I guess it is. Anyway, we can go through here. And this one that you can't blow out. You can't kill the crabs, but you can't really do anything else there. So let's keep going. And I think we're going to want to put a power bomb down somewhere in here just to clear up some space. Not really sure where these enemies are going to go to, but we want to go. Do we want to go up? I can't remember. I can't remember how to go through here. I can't remember how to proceed. Let's see. I guess killing the enemies is a good start, you know. They're just shooting at us at least. Ah, and then we got to get this guy to quit doing what he's doing. Oh, it's right. It's a one way. Okay, great. We got to come around the other direction. I'll show you guys this. This is actually like a one way enemy because he'll he'll uh puff up like that. So what you can do is you shoot him from this side, and you can freeze him, and you can jump over him. But you see that side, there's that block in the way, so you can't freeze him from that side. You can only freeze him from over here. Alright, let's see what's in this door. Oh, I got a save room. I don't need that, so we'll just leave it. You may notice we got 11 energy tanks now, too, so we've got a full, like, 1199 energy, which is quite a bit, a full 1200. Not so bad, huh? And you're gonna have to- dang it, I did it too early. I guess I can kill this guy for a quick harass That would be nice. Oh wow, I guess the charge shot is enough to take that out too. There we go. Freeze him while he's shrunken and doesn't have a big puffball out. And we can sneak by. Actually, we want to put a power bomb down, I think, here. I think like a power up or something underneath here. Oh no, that's just to reveal the speed running blocks. So that tells us what we need to do next. Now this guy here, he's going to puff up before you even get near him, so you're not going to be able to get past him. I don't know why they even bothered to put him there, because there's no way, I don't think, to get through this room. You put a power bomb down, that'll reveal any false blocks, but there aren't any false blocks, so there's nothing really you can do about that. You can't get up there yet. 
Now all you have to do in here is clear enough space for yourself, which usually is just killing this first enemy. Yeah, I think hitting him with a uh, more than one of the beams actually does do more damage. Just clear enough. Oh, I ran into the door. That's not cool. Turn around. You gotta clear just enough space so you can run, get a good start, and then run through here and get your speed boost going before you miss these blocks. Yeah, you see, I didn't get, I didn't start running soon enough, and so I didn't get it going soon enough. I guess I do have to kill that enemy just to clear some space. Get a good charge plasma beam shot. That'll do it. Oh, come on, it takes two? Get out of here. Alright, start running from here. Make sure we get all the doors open in advance. We should start sprinting right as we're on the blocks. Yeah, you see, it just barely does it. And that allows us to get through this door, which is the way we actually want to go. I mean, I gotta say, I'm enjoying doing this LP. I like LP in Game Boy games. Uh, you know, it's just fun. It's real simple. It's, it's a good opportunity for me to put some real commentary into the videos. You know, it's just, I don't know, it's neat. I probably should have shot that door instead of running straight into it. That would have been smart. Let's see if we got anything interesting here. Probably gonna get some puffers. Oh. Space screw attack spots. Dang it, would you get out of here, seriously? Oh my god. Alright, let's do this just the simple way then. Let's freeze him and jump on him. So I can't get him to. I almost said it. I almost said that pun again. You guys know the one I'm talking about. So I almost said it again. And I stopped. I stopped myself. Why can't I hit him? Go a little lower, maybe? There we go. You can land on them even when they're smaller. You don't have to do this either. Oh, come on. Once you got them frozen, you can just space jump past them. If you could do the space jump. Oh my god, we're at the bottom of the again. It's kind of a pain, actually, to try to space jump with these guys around, because they throw off your rhythm. Dang it! Would you go up? Yeah, just grab the wall. Give me a break, please. Ah, there we go. Dude, do I have to get up there? Really? Get over him! Oh my god! Are you serious? This is ridiculous! Not only am I taking a lot of damage, this is taking way too long. I swear I got I just space jumped past these guys in my practice run and then now I'm having a hard time with it. So I guess we'll have to do this old fashioned way. Freeze them. Let me just shoot this out. Is that a missile? Yeah, it's a missile block. What's weird is that these are missile Why did I use a power bomb? I could use a normal bomb. Those are missile blocks there too, but you can't shoot them from underneath. And so there's no way to go through them. You can only come down through that. I'll use a power bomb here, it's the only easy only easy way to clear all those enemies. And it's nice enough to draw the health into us cool too. That's pretty cool. I might notice we have a data room down here. Uh, I'm not really sure what's in this, but we're here, so let's check it out. Is this what I think it is? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, I know what it is. It's diffusion. So now we basically have, essentially, charge missiles. Uh, it's basically like the same thing as charging a beam. You hold down R, and then you can just let go of it and nothing happens. Or you can hit B, and you'll fire a diffusion missile, which will freeze any enemy in that effect radius, which is... If you hit something in the middle of the screen, about the whole screen actually, so just watch this. As you see it takes off, it takes out a quite a few enemies. You see it froze the first two, but not the third guy up there. And here we can run into this area. This is an area above the uh, one-way guy that we didn't get past earlier. If you shoot this out, you can see that there's a missile expansion back there. Just roll underneath the exposed wiring. Roll back. I'll drop down here just to show you. This is where we couldn't go up through before because that puffer. Now we we found a way around him now. All right. So how do we get out of here? We're headed back out of the sector, hoping to make it out of here in this video. Yeah, we're right there. That's the recharge room. Awesome. We're done. We're done, man. <laughs> done with that sector. Now we're probably gonna go get berated by Adam for opening all the doors without him telling us to. I think he actually does get kind of mad at you, but I'm not really sure exactly what he says. Can go ahead and save here. Save the game. You just saved the game. Alright, let's see what Adam has to say. You upgraded your missiles? That's unusual. There is no word from HQ. A procedural error, I'm sure. Or maybe he just didn't tell us. Even so, I did not approve of bypassing security level 4. From now on, you will use more discretion. In any case, Samus, do you remember the security robot you faced earlier? I believe the X have infected it. That is to say, they have claimed the organic components that form its neural network. It has entered Sector 6, Nocturnal. I don't know what it's planning, but let's not wait to find out. Samus, you know what to do. Yep, go kill the next boss. That's kind of what we've been doing the whole game. Get the next power up, kill the next boss. 
I mean, I guess, I guess the game just ends when we run out of sectors, bosses, and power-ups. I don't know, we've already got the gravity suit. We can't be far from the end, right? There's no suit after the gravity suit in this game, so... This is it, guys. I think we've got a full total of, like, three, maybe four more bosses in the whole game. So we're making a quick work of this. I, I didn't expect this up to be, like, 20 parts, but it's looking like it's going to be about that number. Just a rough estimate, maybe more. Uh, I don't know how long it takes to do the final bits of this game. We know we got we know we got some bad guys running around. Ah, oh, we're gonna have to talk to him. Great. All right. Security robot seems to have gotten much stronger. This worries me. Be careful. Well, we've another problem. Once you're done, leave knock immediately. The SAX is tracking you. Is your objective clear? Don't stay longer than you must. Understood? Yeah. We don't want to get killed. Crap. He's following us, man. He's following us, man. He's watching me. I always feel like somebody's watching me. 